series of math scholarship exam tutorial this is fourth video and the topic is perimeter of triangle rectangle square and polygon so let's begin math scholarship exam topic is perimeter triangle rectangle square and polygon question number 1 the sides of a triangle are 5 cm 6 cm and 7 cm what is its perimeter options 18 cm 13 cm 11 cm or 12 cm look at this triangle first side 5 cm second side 6 cm and third side 7 cm now we'll see the addition of all three sides its addition is 18 cm therefore first option 18 cm is our answer question number 2 what is the perimeter of a square having length of the side 6 cm options are first 6 cm second 12 cm third 24 cm and fourth option is 30 cm perimeter of the square is four times side here it is first side second side third side and fourth side which all are equal hence side is given 6 cm four times 6 is equal to 24 cm third option 24 cm is correct answer question number 3 the perimeter of a square and a rectangle are equal if the perimeter of a rectangle is 80 cm what is the length of the side of the square first option 80 cm second option 40 cm third option 20 cm and fourth option is 10 cm here we have rectangle and square and whose perimeters are equal 80 cm is the perimeter for rectangle as well as for square therefore 80 divided by 4 is equal to 20 hence third option 20 cm is correct answer question number 4 the length and breadth of a rectangular ground are 80 cm and 36 m respectively How much distance will be covered in 10 rounds around the ground? Options are 2400 meters, 1200 meters, 600 meters or 480 meters. Perimeter of rectangle is equal to 2 times length plus 2 times breadth is equal to 2 times 84 plus 2 times 36. Is equal to two times one hundred and twenty, so answer is two hundred and forty. Ten rounds has to be covered. Two hundred and forty multiplied by ten is equal to two thousand four hundred meters. Therefore, first option two thousand four hundred meter is correct answer. Question number five: The perimeter of rectangle is sixty centimeter. If its breadth is ten centimeter. then what will be its length first option 10 cm second option 20 cm third option 30 cm fourth option 50 cm let us see this rectangle its breadth is given 10 cm 10 plus 10 is equal to 20 perimeter is 60 hence 60 minus 20 is equal to 40 now we'll divide this 40 by 2 we'll get answer 20 hence second option 20 cm is correct answer piyush walks 5 rounds of a square shaped garden having length of the side 200 meters what is the distance he traveled first option 1 km second option 2 km Third option three kilometer, 
फोर्थ ऑप्शन फोर किलोमीटर लुक एट दिस स्क्वायर ऑल साइड आर टू हंड्रेड मीटर्स पेरीमीटर ऑफ स्क्वायर इज फोर टाइम्स साइड एज साइड इज टू हंड्रेड मीटर्स पेरीमीटर इज फोर टाइम्स टू हंड्रेड इज इक्वल टू एट हंड्रेड एज पीयूष हैज टू वॉक फाइव राउंड फाइव टाइम्स एट हंड्रेड इज इक्वल टू फोर थाउजेंड मीटर्स वन थाउजेंड मीटर इज इक्वल टू वन किलोमीटर देर फोर फोर थाउजेंड किलोमीटर्स इज इक्वल टू फोर किलोमीटर्स देर फोर फोर्थ ऑप्शन फोर किलोमीटर इज करेक्ट आंसर क्वेश्चन नंबर सेवन वट इज द लेंथ ऑफ वायर रिक्वायर टू फेंस अ रेक्टेंगुलर गार्डन ऑफ लेंथ एटी मीटर एंड ब्रेथ फिफ्टी मीटर विद फाइव राउंड ऑफ वायर फर्स्ट ऑप्शन वन थाउजेंड एटी मीटर्स सेकेंड ऑप्शन वन थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड मीटर्स थर्ड ऑप्शन वन थाउजेंड फोर्टी मीटर्स और फोर्थ ऑप्शन वन थाउजेंड थ्री हंड्रेड मीटर्स पेरीमीटर ऑफ रेक्टेंगल इज इक्वल टू टू टाइम्स लेंथ प्लस टू टाइम्स ब्रेथ टू टाइम्स एटी प्लस टू टाइम्स फिफ्टी इज इक्वल टू वन सिक्सटी प्लस हंड्रेड इज इक्वल टू टू हंड्रेड एंड सिक्सटी मीटर्स एज वी हैव फाइव राउंड फाइव टाइम्स टू हंड्रेड एंड सिक्सटी इज इक्वल टू वन थाउजेंड 300 meters hence fourth option 1300 meters is correct answer last question question number 8 the length and breadth of a rectangular plot are 60 meter and 30 meter respectively it is to be fenced with three rounds of wire what is the length of the wire required first option 1800 meters second option 540 meters third option 180 meters fourth option 5400 meters look at this rectangle length is 60 meters breadth is 30 meters again perimeter of rectangle is equal to 2 times length into 2 times breadth therefore 2 times 60 Plus two times thirty is equal to one twenty plus sixty. Addition is one hundred and eighty. As it has to be fenced with three rounds, one eighty will be considered as one round. Three times one eighty is equal to five hundred and forty meters. therefore second option is correct answer hit like button if you like this video if you did not like you have another option too share this video with your friends give comment in comment box so that i can improve my videos subscribe my youtube channel and finally thanks for watching Thank you very much